wrecks to the don't man. Won't take a surfer to the snow bubble. No, no. Don't take a new wreck. Don't take a new wrecks to the. Yeah, we're going to go on that one. Yeah. Now you get into the jam. Don't take a new wrecks to the don't man. Won't take a surfer to the snow. Well, what you could do is, you wouldn't take a surfer to the snow. Why don't you do it, you know, change the lyric yeah. around. Don't take your lyrics to the long man. You wouldn't take a surfer to the snow. Now there's a place for everything, and for everything, there's a place for it to go. This is a rock and roll band, the Skyhooks, in Melbourne. In 1975, going on album sales, they were Australia's most successful pop musicians. Since then, they've suffered a drop in popularity. In 1976, they were out of the country for some time, on tour in America. While they were away, other groups filled the gap. Moreover, an album they made at that time didn't sell well. Now, in an attempt to ensure that their next album doesn't meet the same fate, they're flown out an up-and-coming American record producer, Eddie Leonetti. I think that they wanted me uh, to work with them because they, they felt that they might really benefit from, you know, an American, uh, the United States sort of vantage point to rock and roll as opposed to Australian or something else. An hour after he'd arrived at Tullamarine, Leonetti was with the band at this North Melbourne studio, starting five days of intensive rehearsal. I get involved in what I call pre-production. All right, pre-production is simply going in and rehearsing with the band. And that's where you sort out the songs, that's where you decide what chord changes you want, that's wh where you're gonna decide what guitar's gonna be playing what, what what's the drummer gonna do. And you may rewrite the song, you may change it very little, uh, you may take two songs and, and put them together as one, you may take one song and make it four songs. Uh, a lot of things happen, but you work it all out in rehearsal, pre-production. You don't do all the experimenting in the studio. Not bad, not bad. That wasn't not bad, that one. Uh, I think nice that she be a little, little more confident at the very end. Don't just, don't just yeah. fade out. Don't go out to nothing, you know. It's, it's an end. Make it an end. You, know? you, you should have been out here in a half guy. We were real confident. Then we were real big. We weren't big anymore. <laughs> we, our egos are deflated, and, you know. Cost of living has gone up. Higher PAs is real expensive now. It's your priorities, you know. If, you, if, you, yeah, if, you bring, if your priorities go to the sea and surfing, you know, <laughs> then you lose perspective. <laughs> that costs nothing to hire a wife. Doesn't cost nothing to hire a wife. <laughs> you're learning. You're learning. You're getting there real well. Calling the army by a politician. Promise anything. All right, I like the sound of it. Well, let me ask you something. Um, that little thing with singing. Oh, uh, yeah, well, you don't have to use, you can use that if you want to. You don't yeah, to. I sort of like that. I know yeah. I'm, I'm trying to figure out where we work it in. You know that part with the singing? Ooh, Mega Mania. Ooh, Mega Mania. Yeah, for what it, can we get it in there somehow or other? You know, if B E D M, how do you say it? Uh, the word, the pronunciation on most of this stuff to me is yeah. completely foreign, but that's okay. Idiot, well, idiom you know. Yeah, but I mean, uh, Big black. Big, see, that's, so this song is a big a, black. This, this is a ripoff of Montego Bay. Singing. No offense, madam. Nearly all the music and lyrics performed by Skyhooks are written and arranged by the group's bass player, Greg McCainch, who also founded the group in 1971. Greg has his own ideas on the role of the record producer. He'll, he'll make a suggestion and the band will, will talk about it and we'll try it, you know. Uh, and if, if we're happy with it, we'll, 
will, will do that or what happens is he'll make a suggestion which leads to another suggestion by someone else and uh, you know he, um, he can sort of mediate between the whole the whole thing and it'll uh, it'll come out you know differently but hopefully a lot better yeah I know but what happens here there's a little bit of Adolf Adolf. Well, every way you're gonna say it, but I want you gotta sort of stop for a second to get that out. You know, there's a little bit out of like, everyone. I also like Adolf because that's what Lenny Bruce sort of. Adolf. Okay. There's a little bit of Adolf. Yeah, do it that way. Everyone. You gotta act that out. And the hand that holds the whip. Sometimes it's all the fun. No, keep on going for a second, because now what are you saying? There's a. Yeah, this one's a. F right. Dicky line. Yeah. Sorry, this, this one's a dicky line. I <laughs> so think. They'll be able to repeat that. Desire. You should 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 do that. So my desire. Well, say, sing the way you sing it, because I didn't understand. There's a desire hidden somewhere. There's, yeah, there's... Desire. I think it's a de it should say desire. There's a... How do you say a desire? Yeah, mm. desire. Yeah, so can't you get up to on top of it? There's a desire. There's a desire. Yeah. <laughs> uh, how about just a, a hidden desire somewhere, or something like that, if you change it around a little bit? Mm. Mm. How about... There's a hidden desire somewhere that wants to rock the earth. There's a hidden desire. Yeah. Well, how about... That wants to rock some, the earth. What about somewhere, that somewhere? There's somewhere? A, yeah, somewhere there's a... <laughs> somewhere there's... <laughs> No. no, somewhere, no, no. no. There's a desire, a, a hidden desire would be better. You There's a get, hidden yeah. desire that um, wants to rock the earth. Um, you need somewhere? No. There's a desire hidden somewhere. That's where it gets twisted. Yeah, there's a desire. It just sounds weird. Yeah. It doesn't flow. Does. And you can't understand it at all. Sound. dedicate this song to a Joe Bianchi Peterson when we do it on stage, which seems to go down well for some reason. Uh, but, uh, yeah, oh, well, I mean, it's, it's got lots of overtones in Australia, and Australia's really political, politically active country. There.